What's up, guys? Just wanted to say hey, let you guys know I am okay. Um, I don't know if you can see here. The eye that I got cut in my last fight kind of got swollen again and cut up a little bit. Uh, but it's all good. Uh, to kind of give you a little rundown of the fight, what basically happened... Round one, I was getting stuck with the jab a lot, so he kept sticking the jab to me, and uh, he did pretty good. You know, I held my own and everything, but I, you know, he uh, he was definitely being the more aggressive one, but it was a great, great round. Round two, uh, oh, at the middle of that round, he got me with a rib shot, and for some reason, that rib shot just, I could not breathe. And it was so bad that I almost was like, oh, do I call off this fight? Like, I don't know if I can even breathe anymore. You know, after the first round, I, I was breathing basically like, <laughs> and it was tough. But I would, uh, I was like, I'm not going to stop going. And uh, round two came along and it, it was better. Um, you know, you could tell he was getting a little bit fatigued too. So we were going at it. We were having fun. Um, put on a good show. Then round three happened. And round three was kind of insane. Uh, he fatigued a lot. I'm not going to lie. Uh, so was I. Uh, but for me, it wasn't so much fatigue. It was uh, my rib was killing me, but I, I was pushing through. I could tell he was tired, so I tried pushing uh, on him a little bit more that round. And I think it was like the last 15 seconds he started coming at me. And um, I noticed he would go and then kind of just stay behind. And you could tell he was kind of tired, so I wanted to pick it up. And I was just the last 15 seconds i started egging him on i was like come on come on let's do this like let's do this like let's put on a show for the at the end so we started throwing you know hook 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 st uh, straight straight hook hook just demolishing each other um and then the, you hear the 10 seconds the click 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 and i i start yelling at him again i'm like let's like let's do this come on like come on and um I think it pushed the both of us to really just keep going, and we were swinging until the end of the round, and it was an exhibition match, so there's no winner or loser, technically, um, but it went good, and I think it was nice. I will say, you know, he, ha he I think he has a bright future. He's a really respectful kid, uh, well, guy, I'm sorry, I, I say kid for everybody, but a uh, really respectful guy, and it was a good fight, and we put on a show in front of all those people. So I'm very happy it happened. I was definitely the underdog. We were the loudest fight of the night for sure. Everybody was uh, cheering for Amro. That was his name. They were like, Amro, Amro, Amro. And before the fight even started, everybody was on that guy. So I was definitely the underdog. But uh, it made it even more interesting because, you know, I'm a dog. I love fighting. He's a dog. He loved fighting. And we went to town for three rounds. So it doesn't get better than that.